Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're doing spot on. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. Now, I've been shopping, been to Iceland, look what I've got. Oh, we've got shadows again. I'm very sorry about these. Right, it's a fully loaded mac and cheeseburger pasta, and it says new. So I've seen it and I thought, oh, I must try that. Layered with mini beef, Burgers, gherkins and mozzarella in cheese and mustard sauce. Well, I picked it, picked this up, it was three pound. They do a deal on at the moment, you buy two for a fiver, saving yourself 10 bob, which is 50 pence. So I'm gonna have a look at the back and see how we cook it. So bear with us. So it's an absolutely stifling day out there. It's 25 degrees, I can't believe it. Uh, Cat E, 800 watts, what mine is, microwave, 12 minutes. Or you can do it in the oven, fan 180, gas 6 for 40 minutes. So that's going in the microwave because I've had one of these before, but not this one. I'll go a bit further back. But not this one. I had, I can't remember what I had. Meat Feast, fully loaded Meat Feast, and it was absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to get this in the microwave. Well, I'll get it out and I'll show you what it's like and then I'll get it in the microwave and we'll get cracking into it. So, put that down there. You see we're still in, yeah? Yeah, up oh, there it is, look. Look at all that, look that. You just, that is gonna be, that's gonna taste good in it. Look at the cheese on it. I mean, if you don't like gherkins, that's what, if you don't like gherkins, then you, you're stuck, aren't you? But there it is, look. So, I think you've got to pierce the film lid, haven't you? Pierce the film lid several times, cook for seven minutes, stir, open the lid, stir, replace and cook for a further five minutes. So, I'm going to do that. But first I'm going to say thanks for all them subscribers I've had. I tell you what, it, it makes me feel, oh, it humbles me, you know. Thank you very much, I do appreciate it, I really do appreciate it. Sticking, sticking by us, spot on, thank you so much. And thanks for all the comments. I, I'm, you know, I'm gonna reply every comment, I am. Every single comment, it takes me all night because it's you guys are making this channel, basically. It's you guys who are doing it. And thanks for all the, the kinds of food out there which um, you've been telling me about and I've been going out and buying it. I'm going to have to buy another freezer. <laughs> I'm going to have to get a big chest freezer and throw it all in there. But uh, I'm getting hungry now. It's getting all, It's getting towards lunchtime, so I'm going to get this in the microwave. In fact, I'm going to do it while I'm talking to you, can't I? Have a little, have a little tour of the kitchen. Well, not so much. Oh, sorry about that. All right, that's, that's enough. So I'm going to do it for seven minutes. Oh, that was off. That was off. Should prep myself a bit better, shouldn't I? Right, we're on. We're back on. Uh, yeah, so seven minutes. That's a little... There we go. Right. So I'll get back to you when it's done. So that is that. It's had 12 minutes in the microwave, seven minutes first, then stir, and then another five minutes. <clears throat> it looks like it's got American cheese on it, doesn't it? There it is, look. Let me uh, see if I can get it. Hang on a minute, it's red hot. I can't do that on that. Right, hang on. Well, there it is anyway. Oh, hang on, we've got a better picture then. That is that there. So the beef burgers, the gherkins, and it's got um, mozzarella in cheese and mustard sauce. So I was going to give it the kids. I was going to have some and then have, give it the kids, but I don't think they're going to eat. They're not going to eat this because it's mustard sauce. So there it is. I hope that's a, a bit of cheese hanging down and not a hair. Yeah, it is a bit of cheese. So there we go. Let's have a look at this. So I'm, I'm, it's like a mac and cheeseburger pasta. So. Maybe it's, the gherkins are going to be, I'm thinking McDonald's and Big Mac, you know, with the burger and the gherkins. Let's see what the sauce is like. Mm. 
Oh. Mm. Mm. They're the same burgers that are on the, the meat feast one. Just the same. And the same kind of burgers that are on the cheeseburger pizza. But all crumbled up. Pasta's nice. It's cooked just perfect. 12 minutes in there. These containers don't half microwave it very well. The cheese sauce is quite strong. It's like an American cheese sauce, isn't it? Gherkins are doing what they do. Giving it that taste. I mean, it's all right. It's, if you like mac and, if you like macaroni cheese, you're gonna love this because it's got lots and lots of cheese and the macaroni. But I'm not, I'm not a big big lover of them gherkins in there, I'll be honest. I'm not a lover of them gherkins. Mm, yeah, it's not. It's all right. It's all right, but it's not. It's not. Um, it's not doing it for me. I'll be honest. It's not doing it for me. Mm. I'm not getting mu much mustard sauce flavour through neither. So the kids might eat some of this. I'll, I'll, I'll have to try it, won't I? My wife might have a bit as well. But it's not as good as the meat feast. There it is, look. That is that. Oh, I've just dropped it. I <laughs> just dropped it on the floor. No. Very cheesy. I'm not into them gherkins. I'm not into them gherkins. They're not like what you get on McDonald's. They're like pickled. They're quite pickled actually. And they've got a bite to them as well. Them gherkins. They've got a bite to them. Would I buy that again? Personally, I wouldn't buy it again. I wouldn't buy this again. But it's not going to get wasted. It is not going to get wasted. I'm trying to get a bit of burger. There it is. Mmm, yeah. The burgers are okay. Very burgery. If that makes any sense, it's like that burger flavour you get. But the gherkins, I don't like these gherkins. Not a bad dish, a dish I wouldn't buy again. But you've got to try these things, haven't you? It's new from Iceland, it's three quid. If you get in two, you get it for a fiver, so you save yourself, save yourself a quid, a pound, don't you? So, if you like this kind of thing and you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel, that would be fantastic. And give it a thumbs up. More of this content is coming. I keep thinking there's airs in it, but there's not. It's the cheese. I'm gonna divvy, I'm gonna divvy this out now to the family, you know. I'm gonna see what they say about it. See if the kids will have some. See if the wife will take some off me. I'll just move back with this selfie stick. Um, thank you very much for all the subscribers that has been really really you know can't thank you enough so take care all the best and i'll catch you on the next one